first. So what I will add? I will not add 80 plus 47. I will add 80 plus 51. So there is a symbol of plus here. That's why I will do 80 plus 51. So here I have written 80. Then it is 51. So 1 plus 0 is 1. 8 plus 5 is 13. So I got 131 here. So here 131 you will subtract. Uh, you will subtract 47 from 131. So I will write here 131 minus 47. So as we know from small number, big number will cannot subtract. That's why 1 will become 11 when I ask 1 from 3. So this 2, 3 will become 2. So 11 minus 7 is 4. And 2 minus 4 we cannot do. This will uh, we'll ask 1 from 1 and this 1 become 0. And this 12 will become, uh, this 2 will become 12. So 12 minus 4 is 8 and 0. No need to write it down. The answer is here 84. So we have to follow, as I told, we have to follow the rule. We have to do addition first, then after we have to do subtraction. So any number, any biggest number also given in question, no need to fear, you have to do addition first. So I will give uh, biggest number or largest number, 4 digit, 5 digit number and how to do addition and subtraction at a time, that one I will teach by giving another example. So students, just look at the blackboard. Mm. So students, here another example I given, 615 minus 2407 plus 3118. So you can see here we have to follow the process. If I will do subtract 615 minus 2407, I cannot do. That's why I will do addition first with the number. So 615 plus, as this is 4 digit number, I will start from here, 3118. So 8 plus 5 is 13. 1 I kept upside, this is 3 again, 6 plus 1, 7 and 3. So this number I will write here, 3733. Now I will subtract 2407. So here 3 will become 13 when I will ask 1 from 3. This will become 2. 13 minus 7 is 6. 2 minus 0 is 2. Now 7 minus 4 is 3. And 3 minus 2 is 1. So the answer is 1326. So you can write like this answer. And 1326. So this is the answer. So uh, students I hope you understood how to do addition and subtraction at a time in a question. Before that before solving the question as I told you have to follow some rule. So in the next class something more I will teach. I hope you understood students. Thank you very much.